Hey y'all, it's Lemonette. Um, I know, right? Who would have figured? Um, I was going to make a video so that I could tell y'all I was doing okay. And uh, I appreciate all the comments that people have put on my channel. I really, to be honest, have not actually visited my channel in quite some time. But I do have the notifications on so that I know when somebody comments on my page. And, um... If you've tried to reach me through comments on the videos, I don't get notifications of those. And I just kind of lost interest in YouTube when um, when it started being, you know, trying to worry about how much, how many views you got. And I, it just wasn't fun anymore for me. And that's the only reason I ever did it was for fun. I love to make people laugh, and I love to um, um, make people happy, and I hope that I did that with my videos, and um, we could do it again. I, I'm not going to sit here and say, oh, I'm back, and I'm going to be making videos, but a lot's happened to me since the last time you guys talked to me, or I talked to you about anything in my life. Um, my health is not really that good. I'm not walking much. I'm in a wheelchair a lot of the time. And um, if I drop this camera, just sorry. Um, so my back and knees and neck, I uh, just have so much uh, osteoarthritis and so much pain from that that um, I just don't get around very well. I don't go out a lot because of that. Uh, my husband is very, very sweet and, and good and and helps me to go where I need to go. And my, uh, for that matter, Jamie is too. Jamie, they get me out and let me go to Walmart and because uh, I just can't like make it from the car into the, into the store. I just really can't. Um, but anyway, um, I lost my job back in February. I had been there for 13 years uh, in various positions, including business office manager, but when I left, I was, I just worked in the business office. Um, it became a, a big corporate mess, a lot of corporate stress. Um, they let me go um, with the story that um, they were doing away with my job. Uh, they were, and they were, they were cutting costs, but um, I, you know, was up at the top of the pay grade, and I was, uh, um, liability as far as insurance goes there were a lot of there were a lot of things that I think factored in there and for about five minutes no let's be honest about 30 minutes I was very upset I was devastated um, but then it started to dawn on me that um, I would have died in in that office I would have fell out on the floor because my health was getting worse and worse. I was working, you know, 60 hours a week sometimes. And um, so much stress. So much stress for low, so little pay. It's ridiculous. Corporate America has gone flipping nuts. Um, you know, for what I did and for the stress that they put on me, the pressure that they put on me to get so much done. Uh, and, oh, I wasn't the only one that they were doing it to. It's not like they were picking on me. But anyway, in the long run, they did me a favor. And uh, I wasn't, you know, you'd think after 13 years, somebody just dumping you like that. And then at the age and health that I was at, knowing that I wasn't going to be able to get another job, you'd think I would be kind of devastated. But um, it wound up being such a blessing. Um, uh, you know, I got a sever nice severance package since I've been there so long, so... Uh, and then I, you know, my, I'm going to go into the financial details of it, but uh, I'm going to drop this phone before it's over with. Um, but anyway, I have not gone, you know, without some form of payment. Um, I have now qualified for disability starting in um, August, um, which, you know, I could have gone on disability a long time ago, but you know I'm not. I'm just not that kind of person. I wanted to stay working. I, of course, I, we don't have insurance now, 
my husband is getting on Medicare at this time. He's It's about to go into effect. But it'll be a year more, year and a half or whatever until I can get on it. Um, but anyway, that aside, um, I have a lot of things to be thankful for in my life. Uh, I don't have to get up and I don't have to drive 60 some odd miles a day commuting. Um, and with the money that I'm getting now, if you, you know, take 100 and... 100 to 125 dollars a week gas money that I was spending to go that far every day. Um, I'm really coming out on, on the better end. There's so much less stress in my life. Um, Gary just works two or three days a week, and um, we don't have money to do a lot of things, but you know, we can we get by, we get to go out sometimes, and um. Anyway, it's not a bad life. I'm having fun. I'm hoping now that I have more time that I'll be able to make some videos. And um, funny things happen in my life all the time. It's just that I, I, don't, I no longer make a note of them so I can make a video about it in the afternoon. Maybe that's the only difference. Um, is that I need to start making notes about the funny things that happen in my life. Because let me tell you something. If you live life on this earth you should never run out of material because people are crazy people are funny people are lovable and um i, I still love you all i still you know like i say when i get a message that i've got a, a comment that you miss lemonade and oh it just it warms my heart and makes me so happy and i feel kind of a twinge of guilt that i haven't been making any videos but um Anyway, this video is so long, nobody will probably watch it all the way anyway. But I thought I would come back and let you guys know what's going on with me. And no promises of videos in the future, but I'm not going to say I'm not going to make any either. We'll just wait and see what happens. And um, I love you guys. And um, what did I used to say at the end of the videos? Oh, yeah. Love yous. Bye.